look at this beautiful thing. Well, isn't she pretty? Look at all that bling. Canada's triple clamps. And that's too pretty to even ride. I think I might just park it in the living room as an ornament. <laughs> Beautiful thing. 2019 KTM 450 EXC 6 days version. The only 450 EXC F that KTM makes for the 2019 model year was the 6 days version. And it's got different color plastics and it has different graphics. It says chili right there. ISDE six days, blue on the fender, and it's got an actually a fender topper graphic here. Color matched frame guards, which is standard for all of the KTMs. The six days does also have a skid plate, which the EXC 350 and 500 do not have. The 450 also has machined billet anodized triple clamps. This piece right here and this piece right here the normal ktms just have cast aluminum triple clamps white front fender and white headlight shroud all of the other ktms for 2019 have orange and then this is different to uh, black radiator shroud and black uh, lower fork guards And we have an anodized orange sprocket. Off the top of my head, I can't think of anything else that's obviously different. Uh, there is one thing that is not actually installed on the bike, but comes with the, the kit. Uh, the, it's packaged in with the owner's manual and all the bike information. There's a little snake that connects between the brake pedal and somewhere up here. And what that does is keeps branches and stuff from getting hung up back here, which could potentially bend this brake lever. And something else that a, one dealer told me is the Six Days also has a quick release front axle. I don't remember if it's on this side or on this side, but there's a little quick release lever. You just pop that lever out and somehow or another the axle slides out really easy. I think you still have to loosen these bolts, but instead of having to use a tool on this, you just release that lever and pull it out. I haven't actually seen what it looks like though. One of the first things I'll do is 
remove the factory mirrors and install the same style mirrors that are on my DRZ 400. I do also have a different slim style tail light and rear fender extension slash license plate mount on order. It'll uh, remove a little bit of weight from the back end also. Another nice thing about the EXC models is they do come with a better dual sport tire. And these are Continental TKC 80s. A lot of guys running KLR 650s and bigger adventure touring style bikes use these tires. I definitely won't stick with that style tire. I'll probably go with tried and true tires that I've always used, which is a Dunlop D606 on the rear and a uh, Pirelli MT21 on the front. Anyway, she's a beauty. I can't wait to get it out and ride it, but I won't be able to do that for another week or so. I want to do a bunch of upgrades to it first.